All right, everyone. So remember, I was talking about in my last video, I was gonna make the garbage enzyme. So um, I will leave in the description box below uh, at least a website or a YouTube channel. You guys can check this out. So far, what I did already is I mixed the brown sugar and the water content already, and then I have my vegetables. So these are vegetable scraps right here that was left over from my juicing and other food scraps like cabbage as well as celery lemon and and such so what I'm going to do is put that all inside here and watch it for about three months and show you I guess along the way what it looks like and what it will turn into so right now I'm going to just put all these inside put it right inside here And it creates its own um, environment inside here. You're able to see, I guess, um, the enzymes working. Oops, I'm dropping some over here. So you can see there, it just looked like a Put the cabbage right on top. You just let it soak in there. Okay. And close the top. And there you have it. Now one thing I'll do, I'll put a date today. So today is right now is 12 12 12. So it's December 12, 2012. And say January. By March, by March you should see something, and it should um, be a light brownish color, and then it will just, you know, change. So every day I'm gonna have to like open it up, let it let it release, and close it again, and it's gonna be a process. But I would love to see how it works. I heard it it can clean um, a lot of things, and so I wanted to test that out. It'll be live organisms, and um, I heard it can also, like, if you scratch your hand or you get, you know, cuts and stuff like that, if you put your hand inside here, it'll heal a lot faster. So, all right, so that's it. Thanks for stopping by Chat Show. Thanks for watching this short video. Hope you guys enjoy it. Talk to you guys later. Aloha.